A year ago, going to a World Youth Day was the farthest thought from recent Catholic convert Sam Evans' mind, let alone meeting and delivering a gift to Pope Francis on behalf of his country, Australia. As luck would have it, this is exactly what happened this past week in Poland, when Polish priest Father Eric randomly asked him to present the gift of a gold-trimmed white leather World Youth Day pilgrim pack to the Pope. A bit of, a bit of luck, a bit, of, a bit of being in the right place at the right time. He, he just uh, came and asked me and said, hey, do you want to uh, represent Australia at the, at the World Youth Day? And I kind of said, uh, why me? <laughs> There's so many people that would be better suited to, uh, I don't know, this job because they've been Catholic longer or whatever, you know, would really, really love this. And I feel like really undeserving and so but I said of course of course I said yes. He presented the backpack with two other men, a man from Central Africa and the creator and designer of the bags who traveled from Miami, Florida. Each representative was asked to wear traditional clothes from their country. However, since he was asked while volunteering in Chestakova, he did not have sufficient time to prepare an outfit. Unlike the Central African representative, who even had Pope Francis's face on his clothes. Afterwards, uh, we had the opportunity to uh, to shake his hand and uh, receive a gift. So it was a bit unexpected. I, I didn't expect to, to meet him. Just two months ago, Evans had another opportunity to personally meet Pope Francis. It was during his nine-month stint with Emmanuel School of Mission in Rome. Being asked again was like, oh really? You know, like most people would love to do this once in their lifetime, let alone, you know, twice in, in, a, in a space of a couple of months. So it's really, it's really cool. While Sam's experience is surely unique, one can imagine he's happy he converted to Catholicism when he did.